Welcome to episode 1926, James Leprino, Mozzarella Cheese, King of the World from Colorado, Nine Lessons. This is an outline of episode 1926, lesson one to five. It's lesson six to nine. Lesson one, he's the Mozzarella King of the World. In the United States, it's practically a monopoly. He owns about 85% of the total U.S. market. And he sells more than 1 billion pounds of mozzarella cheese each year. And two, he's very secretive. No videos, few pictures, and he gives an interview once every 20 years. And three, he saw the opportunity at age 19. The youngest of five children of Mike Leprino, he skipped university and joined his father's business in 1956. Lesson four, start small. Entered the market, Mike Leprino almost went bankrupt. 1958, he started Leprino Foods. At six hundred and fifteen dollars. Lesson five, he recruited the cheese scientist Lester Kiesmeyer. He would recruit Lester Kiesmeyer, who once owned a cheese factory in Wisconsin. Kiesmeyer is a scientist who helped Leprino Food secure fifty patents on cheese. Well, that certainly is impressive. Six, listen to customers. Customers from Pizza Hut to Papa John to Domino all have different mozzarella cheese requirements. Lesson six, family few. Two, at the age of 85, he was involved with family feud over the Prino Foods asset. He was last seen on wheelchairs. Lesson eight, he was still seeking domination in his 80s. Nine, long-term partners. Time worked for him until his death at age 95. Business partner Pizza Hut, Little Caesar, Domino, and Papa John, they all been partner for 30 to some 40 years. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.